All right, guys, I'm back with the card trick, which is not done in a long time. And I have a guest here today that's going to be doing the trick with me. So I have a deck of cards right here. This is the blue dragon. So set that right there. Now what I'm going to do is just start mixing the deck up. Just kind of have it sitting out just like that. All right. Now, dude, yeah. I want you to find my favorite card which is the Jack of Diamonds. So point to the card you think is the Jack of Diamonds. That one. Yep. All right. I'm just going to make that mess it all up. So it's this. Actually, I'll just put all the cards in. There. That's a bit better. Here's this card right here. I'm going to look at that real quick. All right. Now should I find the card you think is the Six of Spades. Okay. Trying to keep some variety here. All right. Now, I'm going to try to choose another jack. So I'm going to choose the jack of clubs, which is, yeah, jack of clubs. So, right here, I'll take this one. All right. So, we have these three cards. Let's go to the side. We have the jack of diamonds, six of spades, and the jack of clubs. So that's the trick, and here is the tutorial. All right, so here is the card trick reveal. There's a little bit of setup. No, just kidding. All you have to do is look at the bottom card. That's all you have to do for the setup. Okay? Here what we're going to do is mix up the cards any way you want. But you want to know where that bottom card is. That's right there. All right? What I like to do is put it in the middle, kind of like that. So a lot of people are going to pick this card. So that's really good. So if you pick that card, you can go, I know exactly what your card is. And you can just flip it over and tell them what their card is before, after, before you flip it over. So that's why I put the card in the middle. But let's say the bottom card was Ace of, Dime, Ace of Spades. Keep that in the middle. And ask them to point to a card. They point to this one. I'm going to take it out. Look at it. It's the King of Hearts. Now say, all right, now try to find uh, the king of hearts. They point to this. Then your, the trick is done. So you have the king of heart, the king of hearts. You have the two cards right there. But if they don't point to this, pick up a different card. Now you say, oh, good, or something like that. And then you're going to say, um, I'm going to try to find a card now. I'm going to try to find the seven of spades. And you're going to take the card from the middle. All right. Now the trick is pretty much done. I'm just going to kind of push these cards to the side and say, now, we have those three cards that we have selected. Seven of spades, king of hearts, and ace of spades. And so that is the reveal for this trick. There are many different ways you can do it. I like to put the card in the very middle to let people know, or not let them know, but they're going to pick that card most of the time. So that's why I like this trick, and it's really easy to do. So that's it for this video. See ya.